Good morning, everybody. We are here. He's getting certified for scuba diving, so we'll be doing some great adventures this summer. Stay tuned. Here we are with Steve. Then when I go to open the valve, I don't want to be looking at it. I put it up against the tank, the point to the valve, slowly turning the knob, yeah. clock, kind of clockwise, the pressure, and all the way open. Hoping to see a full tank at 3,000. All these should say about 3,000. And then I'm going to attach it to my DC. How are you guys doing so far? I don't know. Let me turn my tank on, then we'll all know. <laughs> Oh, never mind. I, 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 I get my left and right confused. Well, you test my Always purge before you breathe on it. You don't know what's hiding in there. Have my hand on the knob. These regulators too. Have the knob. Get a nice good swim stroke on like I'm swimming in an endless pool. Just feel the burn for a minute. But if you are very close to that opening, it'll kind of suck you into it and push you out. If you feel yourself going up, swim out of the flow, get out of it, get under control, make sure you don't allow it to blow you to the surface. If for some reason you do continue towards the surface, the most important thing is to blow the air out of your lungs. Okay. If you have an uncontrolled ascent for any reason, whether it's your weights fell out or whatever, the only thing that's instantaneously available to use to blow the air out of your lungs. Okay. You can still bring that out coming up. It's that you cannot hold and ascend. Remember, that is the number one right. thing you can remember, is I do not go up holding my breath over. I hum up when I'm going up. That allows the expanding air to move without instance. So remember, when we're coming up, we're in that Superman position with the fender to fender up, this hand up. If I put my head down and I push that button, the air is not coming out. The gray button is not an elevator button. That is not how we go up. We swim to the surface. We leave the right amount of air in that BC to make this easy for us at all times. Unless we have to release or dump the air, then we do so. Okay, to manage our buoyancy. The most important thing as we dive today is I want you guys to really watch the buoyancy. You only get a feel for it in swimming pool. You'll get a much bigger feel for it here. Because if you're not paying attention to it and you let yourself rise a bit, all of a sudden there the person will start to float away. You need to immediately get back under control. Let some air out. Do what you need to do. Okay? Blow the air out of your lungs it can be something you instantaneously do that can slow you a bit and maybe let you get in position to get the air out. But if you're down horizontal somewhere around, push that button, it doesn't. Remember you got a shoulder up, remember you got a rear up. Okay. Um, now let's talk about the skills we're going to do. The very first thing we do when we enter the water is we're just going to drop on our knees right over here in the shallow water and demonstrate our mass removal and replacement skill and our regulator. All right, looking good, Captain. Woo. Thank <laughs> you. 
Um, oh shoot, is that the apple? You want me to put it over there for you? I'm not going to put them up there. I don't think that's made to go down that right. deep. All right, if you guys are good to go.
Guys, do pretty good. Learning how to use yeah. a compass. Center on your body. Pretty feel pretty good with what you did. Yeah. All right. You want to switch? Let her. It's her turn next, right? Huh? Oh no, she just did that. She just did. Yeah. I did it on the way over. Okay. Did you do surface or body? Thank <laughs> you. 
This time we're just going to swim around. At some point, I'll come up to you and tell you out of air. All right.
I'm the sum total of my ancestors. You know, I carry their DNA. We are representatives of a long line of people and we cut them around everywhere. It's this long line of people that goes back to the beginning of time. Thanks for your support. Much love.